A new study is out tonight. It names this city as one of the fastest growing in the country. That might not be a big surprise to a lot of you, but for home buyers, it is presenting some real challenges. King Five's Britt Moore spoke with a broker who says despite the pandemic, home prices are skyrocketing and a lot of people are eager to move to Seattle. Many home buyers are running into a problem. Sold signs. There just aren't enough homes to keep up with demand, and the pandemic is not slowing things down at all. In fact, realtors say people are still moving into the Seattle area for better jobs and to take advantage of the outdoors. Is it surprising to hear that Seattle was named the second fastest growing large city in the country? Not really for me. It's it's just a continuation of a trend that we've been seeing for the last number of years. A new Wallet Hub study says people are flocking to Seattle for a number of reasons. A trend that's not new, just not what brokers like John Dealey expect to see during the pandemic. A lot of our uh, tech workers are coming out of California. And of course, the housing is much more expensive there. And really the quality of life here there's so many things to do with all the outdoor activities. And Governor Inslee loosened restrictions on the real estate industry just last week, and already buyers are lining up for open houses. So this is the first uh, weekend that we've actually been able to put out open house signs also, so that brought in additional people. Dilly says with the market being so competitive and people out of state trying to get in, it's up to the buyers to step it up. Well, you really have to be ready with your A game. You have to have all of your financial matters in order. There's uh, buyers that are removing contingencies. Seattle isn't alone in this trend. Wallet Hub says Henderson, Nevada and Atlanta are growing even through hard economic times thanks to strong job and housing markets. Britt Moore, King 5 News.